Morning guys, really good post about diabetes diagnosis. Something that confuses quite a lot of people. I've had a few questions overnight about what are the numbers to remember. So a couple of things. Number one, we well, three numbers to remember again, right? Seven, 11.1, 48. You remember these numbers? Seven, 11.1, 48. Seven, 11.1, 48. What do they represent? So seven is the number you're looking for with a fasting glucose. 11.1 is the number you're looking for at either a random glucose or a post OGTT test. And 48 is your number that you're looking for in HbA1c. Seven, 11.1, 48. Remember, you need one reading if they're symptomatic or two readings if they're asymptomatic. 7, 11.1, 48. And there's two things you need to remember alongside. You've got your impaired fasting glycemia, IFG, and you've got your impaired glucose tolerance, IGT. So your impaired fasting glycemia is if you get a fasting result between 6.1 and 7. So they've not hit the 7 cutoff yet, but they're almost there, pretty much pre-diabetic. And then your IGT, impaired glucose tolerance, is if you haven't got an, an, a result of 11.1 post-OGT, but you get between 7.8 and that 11.1 cutoff. So your impaired glucose tolerance, again, pretty much pre-diabetes. Remember, 7, 11.1, 48. One reading if they're symptomatic, two if they're asymptomatic. We're just about to start a CSA course. I look forward to seeing eight of you guys later on today. And if you have the quiz, let me know. Bye.